Hey everybody and welcome to the channel. Well, you're probably missing my usual intro. That's because I'm on the road right now, but no worries. I have a bunch of videos lined up for you guys and I'll see you in a couple of weeks. Okay, enjoy the video. Okay, everybody, well, we're in Maya 2020, and I'm going to show you guys a neat little trick or tool, I would say. And I was kind of surprised because I was talking to an experienced Maya user, and I used this tool, and he never saw it. So that kind of got me thinking, maybe a lot of other people never saw it either. Anyway, enough talking, let's go. So I'm going to take a polygon plane, scale it out, something like that, nothing fancy. And then I'm gonna take a couple of random objects. So we'll take a torus and I'll move that over here and we'll take a cylinder, move that over here and maybe a cube and move it over there, right? And just to make it more fun, I'm just gonna rotate this guy a little bit like so and uh, we'll do that and we'll do that, right? So the snap together tool, as it you know, suggests, lets you snap objects to other objects. So the way that works is you select the object, right? You go up to the modify snap together tool, right? And I'll just go make sure it's reset, reset tool. There you go. So click on it. It will create a little blue arrow. And that's basically a vertex position that you're choosing. If I were to select a different position, so let's go and hit Control Z. Let's say the vertex in the middle right there, that one. So let's go back to Modify Snap Together tool. So that one right there, that would be the orientation. So if I now click on my plane, that's the path that's going to follow, right? So what happens when I hit Enter? Boom, there you go. So here, same deal. Let's say we're gonna uh, hit G on the keyboard to repeat last command. We're gonna go and choose a vertex on the top there, yeah? Let's go over here, again a path, hit enter, and there you have it. Now let's say I don't want the orientation to change, right? I can go up to modify, we're gonna go to snap together tool, option box. Here it says uh, move object only, right? So we're not going to rotate them. We're just going to move them uh, based on the selected vertex, all right? So we're going to hit G to repeat last command. I'm going to click here. I'll have that little arrow. Click there. And as I hit enter, you'll see that the orientation stays exactly the same, right? I mean, is that cool or what? Let me know in the comments. You like it? Okay, thanks for watching. See you guys next time. Bye.